actually am in my, um, I guess, pajama tee because I just got done working in the yard and hopped out the shower. And I'm about to wind down, if you guys don't mind. And um, actually, if you want to sign up for the um, wine club, check out my website, AnjaliaEssentials.com. It is underneath the um, wax melts, the wine wax melt section. Some good stuff. Um, this is Moscato. Can't remember which brand, but it's freaking delicious. I'm already feeling the wine wound down. Wine time. There we go. Oh, we got this hole for my pond dug out and because I'm doing the 100 day or 100 exercises in mindfulness and today was, um, it was, actually I got to mark it off too. Um, spend half your day um, volunteering at a community center and um, I volunteered at my, my own community center because trying to have this all organized that way um, people can drive by and um, get their graduation pictures taken at this event coming up as well and uh, yeah gotta have things looking nice for that so that's what I was doing um as well as a few other projects so yeah whoo now it is my time so reading day number three day 155 of the book though Forgiving one another. Dun, 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 dun. Remember yesterday was confession. Today, forgiving one another. Be kind and compassionate to one another. Forgiving each other, just as in Christ God forgave you. Ephesians 4th chapter, 32nd verse. Forgiveness is something we all want for ourselves, but find difficult to extend to others. Why is that? Do we feel that our shortcomings are not grievous? As someone else's why does that look so weird to me for sure okay or maybe we want them to suffer for the pain they have inflicted whatever the reason we are only hurting ourselves when we refuse to forgive okay say that I'll cheers to that y'all an unforgiving spirit is like a cancer mm, it often steals a person's joy for years okay walking around miserable Mm, 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 mm. what is the remedy first ask the Lord to forgive you of your unforgiving spirit acknowledge that your attitude is wrong receive God's forgiveness for yourself step one then ask him to help you extend forgiveness to the person you have in mind release the debt you feel they owe you this is an act of the will Acknowledge that the person's wrongdoing towards you expose a weakness in your life. Forgiveness is a process. Ooh, say that. You may not be able to instantaneously. Ooh, okay. Because listen, you know I'll be stumbling over words, y'all. Can I say it for the second time? <clears throat> Let me read that again, y'all. Because <laughs> I feel like we own the show. I'm good now. Okay. We may not be able to instantaneously move past the feelings of pain, hurt, and resentment. Each time the offense is brought to mind, ask the Lord to give you the strength to forgive. Ooh. In time, God will heal your heart. Remember how many times God has forgiven you and be encouraged. Oh, say that. Gum is right burn. Say that. Dear Lord, many times I am quick to receive your forgiveness, yet slow to extend it to others. Forgive my prideful heart. Transform my heart to be more like yours. Amen. Mm. Mm -hmm. I feel that. Because, boy, like it's, uh, like, it's not too much that I let bother me. But once it does, it does. And I make it known. And I'm a fan of, if I don't tell you how I'm feeling, I can't be really too mad because you don't know really some people don't really be known where they have you messed up at but once you do you know either we gonna agree to disagree or we gonna handle it how we gonna handle what you know but the wrongdoers some people just be nasty oh my goodness 
those people like when you just screw somebody over for no reason it's just like damn those be the ones you just be like can i forgive you but i mean might as well because i ain't it man people have done some foul stuff to me and they be like holding on to the guilt of it for years and let it fester and then out of nowhere people come to me apologize sometimes god's protection will have you not even being aware of how a person did you wrong but guilt is a mother flipper okay they'll tell you like oh i did this this and that years ago and then i'll be oh so yeah i've had those situations before forgiveness um, but when a person screws me over, I be just like, oh, okay, well, one monkey don't stop the show. Next type of thing. I'm pretty good at not holding grudges, I think. I can't really think of. I don't know. I feel like life throws lessons your way and. If you're on the same accord, then hey, if not, then oh well type of thing. It's not really anything that I let fester and bother me. But I would hope that I'm forgiven if I've done people wrong, regardless if I'm aware of it or not. I would rather be aware that way I'm ensured that I'm not doing wrong. But for the most part, I feel like you would know if you're doing something wrong. I would hope so. Definitely not saying I'm perfect. I'm just saying, like, yeah. But, yeah, I like that. I definitely like that. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, tomorrow's Rejoice in Hard Times. I love this book, y'all. Yes, Jesus turned this water to wine. Oh, you already have. Wine after your shower, a nice hot long shower too, baby. In a nice good book. Vibes, y'all, vibes. Wouldn't you like to read this with some nice wine? I'm telling y'all, check out the website, okay? Angelaessentials.com. Check it out. And also donate and you'll get your um, drawing to be able to win your very own copy yeah, yeah, I'll throw in a wine bottle for you too. There we go. Sign up for the, we have California Wine House or Wine Club. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. Matter of fact, let's make it a whole vibe. The description below, sign up for your, your travel code. Because Cali, yeah. Might as well get the wine. <laughs> I think that's the next trip. After Jamaica, of course. Check out the website. The Cold Lit World. You're all about Jamaica. All right, y'all. Well, until tomorrow, stay tuned. Have a good one and stay lit, y'all. Ah, stay tuned for the Anjali Essentials um, sponsor for the community center. Ah, I'll let y'all know how the pond turns out and for everything for the event. We got about a week and a half left. Stay tuned. Oh boy, we'll see y'all. <laughs> Have a good one.